All right, Shalom. So now let's get, all right, entry 2287. All right, it says a uh, Hagag. All right, it says to hold a festival, celebrate a festival. This can refer to a religious celebration or a revel. All right, you know, but it's, you know, it's not, you know, it's, just, you know, like I was saying, you know, it's not that type, it's not that kind of party. You can't really, um, it can be called a party because, or, you know, it's, you know, a group of people. Or, you know, that's another word for, um, or, you know, party. It could just mean, or, you know, a group of people. You know, how you, you know, like when you go to a restaurant, you know, with your family, let's say that, um, or, you know, they, they say your last name and then, or, you know, party of five or something like that. All right, but, um, you know, once again, or, you know, this is a solemn occasion. Or, you know, it only says that it can refer to, but, or, you know, in this case, it does not refer to, or, you know, um, you know, as far as our revelry. All right. All right, so it says keep, keep a feast, celebrate, dancing, hold a feast, keep a feast, keep a solemn feast. All right. All right, you know, that's it's another, you know, it's like definition and all that, but, um, or, you know, of course, or, you know, for the most part, or, you know, it always goes to, um, or, you know, is this some, something that's supposed to be uh, serious, you know, something that's supposed to be solemn. Right. All right now we're gonna get you know the last one. Right, you know, in the last one is uh, entry um, you know, nineteen o two. All right, and the scripture that is uh, being mentioned are you know Psalm Psalms uh, ninety two and three. It says, upon an instrument of ten right, strings, and upon the psaltery, upon the harp with a solemn sound. All right. Or you know, um, let's just see what this, or you know, means and all that. But um, or, you know, it's like once again, are you know, um, or, you know. Uh, like what, uh, you know, what instrument are, you know, is being played, are, you know, during the uh, Pesach? Or, you know, it's the, uh, you know, it's the trumpet, it's the, um, you know, it's the uh, Shapar. Or, you know, the, uh, you know, the, the ram's horn. Or, you know, but, um, or, you know, as far as, you know, you know, the trumpet, or, you know, that's, that's basically used to, um, or, you know, it, um, you know, symbolizes, or, you know, something, or, you know, something important. Or, you know, it could be like, um, you know, when, or, you know, like, a, a, you know, you have like a fire drill at school. Or, you know, and everyone has to evacuate to safety. Or, you know, or, um, you know, when, um, a thing, you know, when, um, you know, if you're at like a banquet or dinner party and, you know, someone needs to make an announcement, what do they do? Like, they tap on the glass. Or, you know, things like that. Or, you know, it's a, it's a type of sound, you know, that's meant to uh, get your attention for something. All right. All right, Ezekiel 33 and 1. Again, the word of the Lord, thy power, suck you. Again, the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, Son of man. Speak to the children of thy people, and say unto them, When I bring the sword upon the land, if the people of the land take a man of their coast, and set him for their watchman, if when he seeth the sword come upon the land, he blow the trumpet and warn the people. Or you know, and that you know, you know, just generally speaking, or you know, that's the time we're living in. Or you know, but or you know, you know that trumpet, trumpet. 
or you know it's a um you know it's a it's a um or you know whenever you hear that trumpet it means that um or you know see or you know um you know it's your undivided attention something important or you know is about to happen or you know maybe you know maybe there's a council maybe or you know um or you know there, there's like a, a breach in the stronghold or you know and you know the you know the village you know you stay in is under attack you know but nonetheless or you know the, the sound of the, the trumpet or you know um you know symbolize symbolizes something of a uh, great importance or, you know you know that's why you know uh, you know king david he said he, he put that word uh solomon there or, you know and that is um uh, entry 1902 Right. All right. So 1902. All right. It says, um, it says Haggai one. All right. It says a muttering, sound spoken to no one in particular. All right. Meditation. All right. You know, and the sounds we speak are, you know, un, unto the Lord. Are you know, but you know, it's also, you know, a meditation. Are you know, um, you know, we put, are you know, um, put, you know, prayers up. You know, we put prayers up. We put, are you know, curses up. Are you know, and then it says it's got the, um, you know, mispronouncing Higayan. All right, uh, melody, Higayan device meditation. All right, solemn sound. Are right, you know so um you know we're the, you know it's gonna be a solemn sound we're we're you know we're um we're, we're putting up our you know solemn prayers or right, you know and just you know it's hoping that um you know just like every year that it that it's gonna be or you know the last Passover or you know we keep in um in um in Babal or you know you know before it you know gets destroyed. Are you know and that are you know and that we get delivered instead of destroyed with it? Are you know but with that? Are you know we're just we're gonna wrap it up for now, you know and uh, once again are you giving all praise to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem or Kakodash. Double honors to the apostles of uh, so like the apostles of a great millstone, and once again shalom and, and salutations are right, to the hopeful elect. All right, shalom.